Hello everybody, welcome to Comics and More. Today, we are going to make a multi-boot USB. That means we are going to put more than one ISO in our USB flash drive. If you want to learn that, then stay tuned to Comics and More. So that you will not miss the latest from comics and more, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get the latest from this channel. To start off, we are going to head over at pendrivelinux.com and we will search for Yumi Multiboot USB Creator. Yumi Booty Boot USB Creator. Okay, we are going to download it now. You can have the UA5 version or just the ordinary Yumi. Okay, let's download the first download link and then okay, we just cancelled here because I have already downloaded it. And placed it in our desktop. Okay, so since this is the latest version, I'll just download it and replace it and replace the ones we already downloaded. Okay, it's already downloaded. I'll just copy the newer version and put it on our desktop. I'm going to erase this one. I'm going to delete this. And we will focus on creating the multi-boot USB using the latest version of Yumi. I will double-click it. So that we will launch the program. Then we're going to hit agree and create. So here, we'll just put your USB in our USB port. And then we're going to choose this one since this is the only flash drive in our system. And then we will format it as FAT32. Okay, since this USB already contains files, we'll just format it and it will erase all the things that is installed in your, or, uh, that are saved in our USB. So be careful in doing this because it's going to delete all the files. Here I wanted to install the latest version of Zubuntu. 16.04.3 okay this was just recently released so i'm going to click first the amd version or the 64 bit and then create and yes okay in this part of the process you may will try to check the drives if it's compatible and then after that it's going to format the drive like because we checked the box a while ago and here it will extract the ISO to the flash drive okay, this might take some time so I'm just going to speed up the recording and I'll come back a bit later
We are almost done with our installation of the first ISO in our flash drive. So after this, we are going to install another ISO to our flash drive. So just imagine if you had one flash drive and it contains two to three or four or even five operating systems that would be better than making five USBs with different oper operating systems. So we're going to hit next here since our installation is complete. Then would you add another distribution? Then you add or you say yes. So we're going to add this time the 64-bit version. Okay, as you can see here, you can also look at whatever is installed in our USB flash drive. So we're going to hit Ubuntu, oh sorry, Ubuntu, and then the 32-bit version. And then we're going to click on Create. Again, since this might take a long time, I'll just pause the recording and then I'll speed up the video. Now it's done installing, so we are going to click next. Then add more distro will say no, thanks for using Yumi. Now I will show you how it will look like when your machine restarts and you boot from the USB. So let's try to boot the Zubuntu we have just installed. Okay, now it's going to boot. So that is it. That is how you make a multi-boot USB drive using Yumi in Windows 7. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you have questions or clarifications, please leave your comments down below. Again, thank you for watching. Comics and more.